Grace personified in my opinion. This English setter looks a picture this evening. Show champion Bornhouse Royal Colours. Roscoe's four years old. He has 19 cc's. Penny Williams bred him, handled him, she owns him, and of course the kennel, the family involved with the kennel, has such a long history in producing really beautiful English setters. The big thing when you're judging the setters is to look at the breed elements that define each setter for itself. You don't want the English setter to look like the Irish setter or the Gordon setter or the red and white. This dog is breed tight for the English setter. Just the right size and stuff. So beautiful head. Great to turn. Lovely. Very elegant. Well done, Dave. He's having a great performance here tonight. Showing that perfect pace for the English setter. And again, tail action conditioning tight all in one. I was here when his great great grandfather won in 1977. He does remind me of So composed. Obviously an easy going dog. Lovely tail action. Never stopping. Coming to four. Well, this is uh, nothing new for Philip, champion Jaffrak, Philippe Olivier, was here in exactly this position last year at the show. The giant schnauzer, owned by Mr. and Mrs. Cullen, and they come from St. Leonard's on sea in East Suffolk. And uh, it's Kevin out there, showing the dog tonight. Philip, top dog all breeds 2003, but uh, repeating its best in group and here in the best man show this year. Well, well Kevin has only been showing dogs for about five years, but what a job he makes of it. He's <laughs> making much. You know, the, the bond between dogs and handler here is amazing. He trains the dog himself. It's always a matter of only five years' experience. That's amazing. And for three of those five years, he's had this dog in the top echelons of dog showing in this country, which is a tremendous achievement. Good breeding behind him, fair enough, but brilliant handling and putting the dog into the ring in such fantastic condition. Now, this has got to be the real surprise of the evening, a huge amount of support from the crowd. The pastoral group winner, the last of our groups, the Tervuren, the Belgian Shepherd Dog, of course, champion of Domberg, Reeve Dumbledore, India. She's 10 years old, she's been top brood bitch in the breed, producing three champions in her first litter. She's the bitch CC record holder for Linda Collins. What a dog to own and how fantastic to get her into this final best of show. We talk about genetic diversity here. Oh, right. Sorry, I'm just amazing. I'm hopeless in short. I'm sure we're going to do that. 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 Three, Jim Lanning will now go and look at them all again. Now, whether or not she'll go down yes, the line, we'll she knows. She's just going to make them move straight up. That's good. Three, she's seen them from the side. Now she's three, looking up front and back. Watch it to see which way it goes. Coming to one. With on one. Quality, and you'll Thank you, too. I know what you're up to. Coming back to three. On three. This is one great assembly. And, I, and the other thing is, you're looking for performance, three, and they're all over. giving it tonight. No one's letting it down. Look at that. You're going to be Coming to three, three, taking it on one, it's on the right side, on one, and it's a hair's breadth that separates them, and it's a heartbreak that only one can win. Probably five next. We also can't get too carried away with performance, it has to be appropriate for the breed character, so we just have to process that. Keep that breed standard in mind. This chihuahua has got a gorgeous head for a chihuahua. It's very important. And a tail. So all those elements that go into weighing it against its breed standard. Well, strangely, there were two wonderful chihuahuas. The long hair was also a very fine dog as well. And uh, this one came through on top. And to get everything right in detail five again, in a toy five. dog is even that much more difficult. And this again, the, the surprise package. Coming to one. Uh, one. one. Wonderful, wonderful dog. And totally unfazed by the situation. Four. She's smiling at everybody. Is that Liz or the she bring? Well, I meant the she bring. I'm sure Liz was too. <laughs> this is a new set of horse. What elegance this dog has. Very popular breed here at Crofts and that's been over the years. The judge just checking on the, on the forward and rear movement of the dogs in this last run up and down. What is it the dog breeders always say? If they're made right, they'll move right. It's the true test of confirmation to see how all the parts fit together in harmony. That dog is the German. I know it's Belgian, isn't oh, it? So yeah. Five the, next. Uh, the Belgian Thank you, uh, to see you. again. On five. Coming to three. Coming to three. 
Let's have a, a quick snap decision, Wayne. Well, my heart's with Coco the Terrier, but I'm sticking with the chance now. So. On four. Frank? Can you give me a wide one five? I think the you know that you're, you're down the line shot. That's it. That's with it. Such confidence. Well, Thank you, four. Let's see if the smallest can pull us off. And Jess? I have to agree that Chihuahua showed its little heart out, but I think the giant schnapps is on fantastic form, or maybe it could be Coco, or maybe it could be the Sheba. I can't make that up. That's the awful thing, isn't it? I'm, I'm rather taken by the Tavura, but I've got a sneaky feeling it could be the Sheba, and I think it could be a real surprise here. Absolutely, I might here. go along the work with you there, Pete. You know I always hedge my bets. <laughs> <laughs> year after oh, year. Thank you, too. Can we see uh, two? Back two, please. Terrific. Come on. She's just had a last one. She's made her decision. There's no, there's no question she knows which one she's going to give it to. Let's be dramatic, Jean. This is Heart stumping. Oh. 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 Coming to three. Uh, imagine on three. The one takes the winner. One of those face Look them at those down. Magnificent animals. They're all showing. They're all playing the game. This last long look. Very important. And down to it. Yes. Coming to three. And the next one got on one, coming to one. Let's have it. Down to the dog, please. The English sector. Five to two shot on the podium, please. Thank you. Coming to five. Coming to two. On two. Coming to three. Stand by Claire. Coming to one. Let's have one on the trophy. Right. Just this is Aston coming in from the frame one. Right. Claire in, please. Oh, no presentation. Cue the presentation, please. Cue the presentation. So we're now going to have the presentation, which will be made. Thank you, Juan. Thank you, Paul. The presentation party are stepping down into the ring. The presentation will be made by Richard Kellen, who's the managing director of Pedigree, who are the principal supporters of Crofts 2005. Coming to five. accompanied there by the chairman of Crofts, Ronnie Irving. What a marvellous moment for... Just give me a clear when I can get clear in. I will. Let me just concentrate on this. And Peter, uh, just... Uh, can you sit two, please? Thank you. Can we just talk straight? Thank you, Paul. The noise, the lights, she just isn't crazed by anything. Having such a good time. And four, three, you take Claire, and five, you look at the name. Coming to one, there's the trophy. Right. Well, it's not the first time you've had a dog smaller than the trophy. The Shut up, Peter. Claire's coming in. Cue Claire in. And cue Claire in. And do the interview when we can. Claire coming in. Claire coming in. Shut up, Peter. I can't. Well, ladies and gentlemen, seven absolutely fabulous dogs. But one best in show. It's Coco the Norfolk Terrier right, and Peter Green. Uh, you must be through with this. Which camera's that coming up on, Claire? I, I haven't shown her in two years, and she's shown her weekend for me. Thank you, Wap. She's great, great, great. I've got it on the uh, handheld. Well, she's had such Coming a long four. journey over here. Four. This is her last show. I mean, it's a fairy tale ending. Yeah, that's it. The whole for me has been a fairy tale. Coming back to you, Pat Aid. That's been Peter Green. Uh, Super. Uh, Staying on that I've shot. Blue Death. Coco, would you like to say something? <laughs> Not now. She is a superstar. Okay. And Claire can clear. What you want to do, Claire. This is really something for me. Finish the interview whenever you want, Claire. Absolutely fantastic. Coco, thank you for talking to the BBC. Congratulations. Coco, best in show for Cross 2005. Well done. Pick up on PA. Lap of on it. Coming to four. Claire to get to the side. Like Claire, please. On one. Well, there's the head of that gorgeous little dog. As I said, smaller than the trophy. They'll take a lap of honour now. Claire standing by. It's a great honour to be the reserve, but the day belongs. Watching by. Gorgeous little Norfolk Terrier, Coco, champion. Watching two, two. Coming to one. And I get him. One. This is an absolute treat for all 
Watching five, five. Coming to four. Tell me when you want that by Claire. Stand by Claire. I'm sure Thank you, Peter. Peter. I mean, that is to two. Any count? Can we answer two? Coming to one. Explosive drive, super volcano, and <laughs> 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 